Hello everyone, this one is the Ada Mini Pro. Usually when we use it, let's pay attention to the interface at the back. It has a USB-C output. I will connect to my computer. And here's an HDMI output. I will connect the screen. At the same time, I can choose between multi-view or PGM. I was thinking, can I connect to USB-C hub? Then connect to USB-C interface of this USB of the Mini Pro. I have a lot of interfaces like this. I can connect my Samsung memory card. At the same time, I can also connect to OBS Studio on this computer. Is that okay? The answer is no. Because the USB output of this is the output of webcam. There is no way to connect to this USB-C hub. I would like to introduce a product from my company. This is called a USB webcam streaming adapter. After connect USB webcam, convert to HDMI appeared. Then there's the so-called UVC bypass output. There is also the so-called HDMI output. I use this principle. I'm in the USB webcam output connected to the Atom Mini Pro. USB-C after connecting to this converter. In addition to the original multi-view. Another group of PGMs can also be generated. That is, multi-view and PGM come out at the same time. Also connected to the OBS of the computer. It can also record your Samsung memory card. I just need to click here to record. There is a red LED light on here. So I started recording. Then stop recording. Just press it once to stop recording. Aside from that, it can also connect to your iPhone. What I am preparing now is a lightning iPhone. If it's a lightning iPhone, use this lightning to USB 3 camera converter. Then if you are a USB-C phone, you have this USB-C hub ready. The usual cheap ones can be used. Then I first connected this lightning to USB 3 converter to the iPhone. After that, there's an interface here. Let's connect it to my converter. Here is an iOS output. This way. Okay, this is what we're going to turn on your iPhone. App Media Link Switcher. Open it. Then use your hand to draw to the right. Add. There is a tool called a capture. Press it. You can look at your iPhone as an extra screen. Or live stream on it with your iPhone. Turn on the sound. Hello? No problem. About this USB camera streaming adapter. How to connect the operation. I'll show you the next step of the operation. This is Adam Mini Pro. Let's connect the power supply first. His physical HDMI output. I'll connect this screen first. This screen. I start by choosing what is called a multi-view. Wait a minute PGM. It is produced by this red box. Okay, let's do this first. Then let's connect this video source first. This camera. Suppose this camera is turned on. Oh, that's all. Then the USB-C output of this one behind him. I connected to this red box. USB camera streaming adapter. Let's start by connecting a 5 volt power supply. Please be careful. This is a transformer for a 5 volt power supply. Please connect to your first connection. 110 or 220 volts outlet. Let it stabilize for 5 seconds. And then, then put this transformer out of this power supply. Connect to it. Why do you need this? Because the transformer will be unstable when it is just plugged in. So you have to wait 5 seconds. Let it have a stable 5 volt voltage output. Connect to this converter. This will protect your red box. Okay, and there's a webcam in here. I connected to the Atom Mini Pro. This USB-C for Atom Mini Pro. It connected. Connect up. At this time, you will see that this blue LED light will turn on. Tell me about your Atom Mini Pro. And your red box. The connection is smooth. 
At this time, we first connect its HDMI output. I connected to this screen. Here. That's it. Good, at this time, I have achieved it. Mulview and PGM at the same time. Good. And then I can connect it to my SSD card again. The recommended one is Samsung's SSD card. Its format is called XFAT. You can click the record button here. Press it. This will not produce a red light. Then you have to stop recording and press again. It will flash. After he finished flashing, you can pull it out. Okay, let's do it again. Connect in. Then press it. Oh, does he have a flash now? This is not good. We'll have to wait for him to finish flashing and then press again. Anyway, you are in the process of recording. This red LED light must be stable. No blinking. We connect to my computer OBS again. Let's prepare another USB cable. This shipment will be given to you. That's it. Then connect to my laptop. At this time, open OBS Studio again. Oh, there is a live video. No problem, look. Not bad. Finally, this converter is called iOS. I connect to my iPhone. If your iPhone is an iPhone of Lightning, use this Lightning to USB 3 converter. If your iPhone is a USB-C iPhone, Please prepare a USB-C hub. This USB-C hub is a very cheap one. It can be used for less than $10. This is iPhone SE 2. So I prepared this lightning to USB 3 converter. Then I connect this USB cable to it. Some friends will say, can I use a lightning cable? Connect directly to this. This is no, it is not usable. Be sure to wear this converter in white. Can be used. And then connected. Download app. It is called it Media Link Switcher. It's free. If you have a link to our converter. Watermark of this Media Link Switcher. It will disappear on its own. If you are not connected, it will also appear here. Because there is still a watermark now. Because I haven't added it yet. The video source of this converter. How to add it. Your hand touches the screen. Add to the right. There is one called a capture. Press. Look. After I added it, you see that watermark and it disappears by itself. This app can be used for Facebook live broadcasts. YouTube live stream or RIMP live broadcast is fine. So detailed live broadcast settings. Please take a look at my comments in this comment area and that video. Well, it's the same time. PC OBS Studio. Multiview and PGM. iPhone as TV monitor or streaming use. There is also a video recording of your Samsung SSD card. Turn on the sound. Hello? No problem. That's all. This is a detailed introduction to this USB camera streaming adapter. Detailed process of how to connect to Atom Mini Pro. Hopefully, this one box will help you with your Atom Mini Pro. Red box. You can extend the functionality of your Atom Mini Pro. Then it is more powerful.